Hey, what's up guys? Rideshare Guy here, and today I'm going to be answering the question, can I still get a retroactive Uber driver sign-up bonus? So this is a question I get from readers all the time, and generally it's people who are just signing up, or even if you're an existing driver and you're out there referring new drivers, this is something that should be important to you because a lot of people will find Uber through an advertisement online or something like that, and they may sign up without a bonus code. Um, so let's say you're already driving, but you didn't sign up with anyone's code and you didn't get a sign up bonus. Is it too late to get a bonus? And the answer is no, it's not too late. You can actually still get a bonus because the current Uber policy allows for drivers to retroactively add a referral code within 15 days of activation. And I'm actually glad that this policy is in place because for whatever reason, I've gotten multiple emails from readers who use my link to sign up, but for some reason or another, when they check on their bonus and the terms, it doesn't show that a bonus code was attached to their account. And the only way to actually get one of these um, sign up bonuses is to sign up using another driver's account. So I think it's definitely a good policy that's in place. And I've also heard of situations where drivers will sign up with someone's link and then they go in person to get their vehicle inspected or something like that. And basically something happens along the way where their code with the code gets unattached to the account and then they're not eligible for a bonus and the person who referred them isn't eligible. Sort of bad situation all around. Luckily, all you have to do though is email support at uber.com, let them know that you signed up and forgot to attach a referral code and they'll usually ask you for the code and the driver who referred you, they'll ask you for their name, their Uber email, which is important, and their Uber phone number, right? The phone number associated with their account, because that's how they look it up. So if you're watching this video, you can email me for that info, um, harry at therideshareguy.com, and I'll send you all that info. If you're a driver who used my link or if you signed up and forgot to add that code, you can sometimes also try doing all this in the help section of the app, but I haven't found that that worked as well. I sort of use that as a secondary if it doesn't work over email for some reason. And then if all that doesn't work, you can actually also try and have your referrer initiate it from their side, right? So let's say you signed up to drive using my referral code and it, you know, you're not getting anywhere with support. You can email me and I can try to initiate it from my side. And the same thing, I would use your Uber, your the name associated with your Uber account, that your email associated with your Uber account and your phone number associated with your email account. So once you've got the code applied, make sure that you email support at uber.com to get the terms because usually let's say you'll have to do 50 trips in 30 days from the day you were activated or something like that and they are pretty strict with those rules and regulations so make sure that if you guys do go and sign up with a referral code that you check on the terms you check on the bonuses and you know one thing that drivers always ask me is where can i get the best code right where can i get the best sign up bonus and actually the sign-up bonus, right? Let's say you haven't signed up yet to drive with Uber or you did sign up and you want to apply this retroactive code. The sign-up bonus that you get is purely based on the city that you're driving in. So no matter whose code you use, if you use my code, if you use someone else's code, you're going to receive the same bonus and that person who referred you is going to receive the same amount because it's all based on your city. So, you know, you might go and see, and there are different links, right? If you use my link to sign up, it might say 500 bucks, but you always want to check with Uber because my link might say $500 because in LA, where I'm a registered Uber driver, new Uber drivers in LA get 500, but in your city, it might be different. So you always wanna check support at uber.com, really good resource. You guys can check on the amount, the terms, what you're gonna get, and then that way you know that, hey, you, you can use anyone's code, it doesn't matter. You know, if someone's telling you, um, oh, I can give you a better code than some other driver, you know that they're full of crap and you probably shouldn't be talking to them, shouldn't use their code because they're trying to hustle you. Every driver is gonna be able to give you the same bonus because it's all based on your city and you can actually verify that amount by emailing support at uber.com so if you guys have any questions you want to ask me more about retroactive uh, uber sign up bonuses you want to take advantage of this definitely shoot me an email leave me a comment below and i'll try to respond as quickly as possible so if you have any other questions let me know feel free to like comment subscribe to the channel and look forward to hearing from you guys soon take care